This is my ultimate stress reliever. A time when I can just be by myself for a while and uh, create. As with anything else, uh, sewing is like stages. Each piece comes together until you're exactly where you want to be. And sometimes I don't even know what I'm going to make. <laughs> it starts to come together as I'm doing it. Most of my guys, I've made every piece of uh, boxing attire that they've had, because they know that eventually their garment will be finished and, and they can revel in it. The red, the green, the black, as they integrate, tells a story. The colors of Africa, and every time I do a piece of artwork, I like to have a story come out of it. This party's starting to really get going now. I know they appreciate what I do, so I just keep doing it. Before the night's over, there's gonna be a beautiful, beautiful uniform ready for fight night on Saturday. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Thank you. Everyone in? Thanks. Everyone in? Thanks. Yo a las mujeres quiero desde que supe, desde que supe que morena es la Virgen de Guadalupe, de Guadalupe. Hola a todos, ya estamos aquí en Las Vegas. Gracias por su apoyo. Nos vemos ahorita en, el, en el, la gran llegada aquí en el MBM y nos estamos viendo toda esta semana y si Dios quiere, el sábado para la pelea. Muchas gracias a todos por su apoyo. Es una, una pelea pues, con el segundo mejor peso, peso medio en este momento, así que haremos historia y, y, y para eso estoy aquí en el boxeo. With Canelo, it's like he has everything to lose. And, and watching him in camp, uh, he's, he's more than ready for anything that, that Jacob brings. It's not the short of a miracle to be at this point. I want to bang. I want to embarrass him. Like I've always said, this is the name of the game. This is boxing. Ain't no buddy buddy inside that ring. When that first bell ring, I'm going to go in there and try to take your head off. Yeah. It'll start in two minutes. I'm a better fighter than Canelo. I am the best. I'm at my physical peak. When you're throwing almost 100 punches around, you can never lose a fight. We're prepared to do so. I'm looking forward to a knockout. No, soy un peleador más completo, con más experiencia. A mí no me importa si es más grande, si es más chico. Realmente yo tengo mis habilidades. Soy un peleador con mucho talento que puede con eso y con más. Tyrant. Oh, I'm dead, bro. Did Canelo do all this? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> Mentally, it's definitely a toll. You have to do 20 different interviews, but it comes with the territory. Do you go into this fight with a plan of, you know, fighting out of a southpaw stance at all? Or when I switch southpaw, I'm even longer to reach to, and Canelo Alvarez has shorter arms, so Floyd may well always say, true champions always adjust. We know that he's going to change the guard, but we did a preparation for that type of fighter. 
Please welcome, ladies and gentlemen, Canelo Alvarez. Yo pongo siempre todo arriba del cuadrilátero y no vengo nomás a, a pelear por pelear. Vengo a ganar. I have not only the gut and determination, but I have the skill. Canelo Alvarez is in for a big upset. No, Las Vegas para mí es como, como mi segunda casa, ¿no? Pues ya lo adoptamos así, eh, las fechas tan importantes que es 5 de mayo y, y, y 16 de septiembre son las fechas más importantes para los mexicanos y en Las Vegas se festeja a lo grande, así que para mí es como mi segunda casa y lo siento así. Hacer historia, hacer historia y seguir haciendo historia como la que estoy haciendo. Creo que eso es lo que, lo que quiero, ¿no? Lo mejor y estar satisfecho con con mi carrera también. Canelo, I've, uh, I've been impressed with you from day one. And what has impressed me about you is that after each fight, you seem to have learned something in that fight that has made you who you are today. Is that the case? Me gusta aprender en cada una de las peleas. Me amo el boxeo, de ver aprendo. Me gusta practicarlo y creo que soy una persona perfeccionista que que le gusta estar aprendiendo. Yo siempre estoy confiado en lo que hago, en mi entrenamiento, en mi preparación. Y eso es lo más importante. Well, this is an opportunity that wasn't easy getting to the stage. I had to go through so many different ups and downs and I am the dictator of my 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 destiny. I control my destiny. Any issues today just making that making your 160? Yeah. Normally felt normal going through it. Ladies and gentlemen, damas y caballeros, this is the official weigh-in for the middleweight championship of the world, the Miracle Man, Daniel Jacobs! You're from the U.S., you have a great backstory, you have an underdog story, you have everything that Americans love in an athlete, but you go out there for the weigh-in and you get booed at home. What does that feel like? Doesn't hurt me. I know Canelo is a popular guy. His people come out to support him, and he's the face of boxing. Where I come from, we didn't grow up with a silver spoon in our mouth. We didn't have people cheering us on. It was always boos. Danny Jacobs to the scale. You're 28 now. You've had obviously a huge career. How long do you want to go on testing yourself against the best? Eh, toda mi carrera hasta que me retire. Oh. <laughs> en el boxeo uno nunca sabe. <laughs> you know, in boxing, Por lo menos cinco años ya. Estoy en uno de los mejores momentos de mi carrera, sin duda. Creo que puedo dar más, agarrar más experiencia, sentar más mi boxeo. Creo que puedo dar aún más, pero estoy en uno de los mejores momentos de mi carrera. Here they are, champion versus champion, ladies and gentlemen, face to face, 24 hours away from their historic meeting.
I feel like I'm the best middleweight in the world. And that motherfucker right there, he gonna get it tomorrow. Watch that shit. Back then. Let's go. How did this come about? Tiene miedo. Eso es miedo. Bumping me with that big ass head, it's time to put on. I'm gonna talk with my fist tomorrow. No tengo nada que decir. Solamente como. Lo voy a decir en español para que todos se me entiendan porque es puro mexicano. Que chingue a su madre. I try to be cool. Yup. Gonna bump me with his head? That motherfucker. That motherfucker. Bump me. You seen that shit? I heard it. I could have took his head off. Mm. Motherfucker. Motherfucker. Amo lo que hago. Amo el boxeo. Disfruto todo esto. Todas las peleas son peligrosas. Obviamente sabemos en esta que el rival es un peleador que tiene experiencia y pues por eso la hace más aún más peligrosa. People declare Canelo as the best middleweight in the world. So for me to fight the golden boy in his prime, I don't think it could have come at a better time because at this moment I am at my best. You gotta be careful with that thread. You pull it too hard, the whole yeah, thing. Yeah, that's what I'm afraid about. That thread is strong. <laughs> Time to rock, son. All your life, this is what you trained and studied and worked for. They all look shook. They all look shook. See you later. Yeah, look at his trainer. That's right. Yeah. I read the dressing room here, so. I got you, boy. I got you. Hola, Ready? You ready? Mm -hmm. I'm not scared either. I'm excited. I'm not nervous. I'm just gonna go out there, punch him in the face as much time as I can. Love you. See you soon. Okay, baby. <laughs> Ve, te lo doy, te lo doy. Toma. <laughs> ya ves, ya toma. Okay, guys, I need everybody out. All right, cameras, let's go, guys, let's go. One more camera. Okay, we're going with the unified rules of boxing, which means no standing eight count. Can't be saved by the bell in any round, could the last and final round. Three knockdown rules wave. However, after so many knockdowns, it's gonna be my discretion, but I stop a fight or not. Do not hit him when he's down. If your opponent's holding you with one hand, you have one hand free, you can punch with that one hand as long as it's a legal area. Yes, sir. But when I tell you to stop punching, stop punching. Lastly, whatever happened at the weigh-in, that's over with. Yes, sir. Okay, yes, sir. I expect both fighters to be professional and conduct yourself as a champion. Good luck to you, God be with you. Yes, sir. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank, Thank you. you. All right. Thank you, guys. Gracias. Stand in front of the flag. You are Team Canelo, right? Yeah. Se pone canción de Maluma y aparece Maluma. Don't have to be strong to him. Right, right, right. Be fast to him. Yep. 
That's it. That's your and that thing comes when the time you see it come. Mm -hmm. And you open it up. That's your thing. Hi, bro. Excuse me. Thank you. Thank you, buddy. Tiras el jab. Voy a tirar muy poco. Depende, pues, porque tiras el jab y agarra aquí. Está más alto, Lea. Recuerda, este es el chiquito ahí. Y de arriba hacia abajo y Nice little step around. There you go. Beat him in a circle. Beat him in a circle. Hunt like a shark. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Let's go. Make a fucking scream for you. Let's go. Let's do what we do. Now making his entrance to the ring. The reigning, defending WBC, WBA, middleweight champion of the world, in Guadalajara, Jalisco, Mexico, Saul. Ready? Let's go. Let's do this shit, son. Let's go. Yes, Mac. Come on. Let's go. Middleweight championship of the world. Canelo Alvarez defending against Daniel Jacobs. This is what it's all about. Both men like to slug. They can brawl or they can move. You see the size difference. Jacobs is the taller man, but there is just thudding power from Canelo Alvarez. in this round. Touch him around the sides and up the middle. But the jab has to be constant. And a fascinating fight so far. That it could probably go either way. Round four, there is menace in the air. Back on the jab. Lots of jabs, nothing landed. This is fantastic defense in this round from Canelo, and he punctuates it with Don't a jab. Don't waste a jab! Get on the flavor! Look at him slip all these shots. The hardest thing to do in the ring, make the man miss. It's a beautiful display of defense on Canelo's part. Wow. Don't worry about his head. Touch that body. Slow the little man down. And keep pegging him with that stick until you find your combination. You got to work sharper. Round number five, and Canelo continues just to slip punches beautifully. Look at this. He continues to do so. Floyd Mayweather style. Up the middle. Look for that uppercut. Again. Daniel Jacobs is going to have to change this equation because this is Alvarez's fight. Don't wait for the next step. Step, step, fire, step, step. You letting him get out of the range of it, then you end up reaching. Ahí está. I don't give a fuck if you found him, you do anything, don't shake his hand. Don't be nice. Let that right. motherfucker know where you, you the come man. from. All right? All right. You when you stay strong, forward, your hands just go. We're not going to go to the end of this fight thinking right. that we didn't do enough. OK.
punch comes from a left-handed angle. And he missed that punch. In between those shots, he turns southpaw, and you don't even know it. Southpaw's working, coach. These are the rounds. He's going to have to change something. Okay. Trying to get some power on it now. Wax him on the hip. Hard right hand. Canelo landed that. He was waiting for that. There's a change in Jacobs Bovada right now. He's doing that. He's doing that. We're seeing the last hurrah here. We're letting it fly. Come on, Danny. Now listen to me and listen to me carefully, son. These are the most important two rounds of your life. Yes. Faltando rounds, Santito. Faltando rounds, vamos. Hay que ganarlos claramente. This way, the rumble comes in there. Three minutes long. Let's go. Put the money in the bank. Put the money in the bank. It's the first time Jacobs has been coming forward. Now he has Canelo against the ropes. Moving in, still in the south ball stance, but now moves orthodox. Yeah, there you go. Just not a lot of answer back from Canelo Alvarez in this round. Find it. We got three minutes to take this shit to back to Brownsville. Vaya, me lo más agua. Otra agua. Otra agua. Go. Pull him up this round. Push him up against the rope. Not too pretty. I'm gonna hold on. Don't see it again. Let's cerrar lo fuerte. Vamos a cerrar lo fuerte. Es el último round, Saúl. ¿Eh? Ando con velocidad. Con... If it goes the way it has here, it would seem all the belts are going to Guadalajara. Renewed intensity here in the final round, no question. Gánalo con inteligencia, mijo. Oh, winging a big shot. That's a slip. Jacobs trying for it. Slip there in the middle of the ring. Time, time. Go over there. Give me a towel. Tony Weeks going to try and drive that up. You know, at a certain point, you have to make a decision whether you're just going to lose on your feet or get after it and try to take the man out. That's a good answer there by Jacobs. A little two punch combinations. Alvarez with a hook and then a three punch combination. Excellent action here in the final round. Right hand and an uppercut by Jacobs. Really good uppercut by now Jacobs. Now he goes to the body. Daniel Jacobs picks it up. Daddy, Daddy, Daddy. Uppercut lands by Canelo. Stay on him! Ten seconds! Final seconds. What's left? Ten seconds! Daniel Jacobs touches gloves. He brought what he could. Bien, bien, bien ganado. Canelo Alvarez waves to the crowd in what looked like just an outstanding performance in a title defense. You won that! You won that! What an opportunity. What a wonderful, amazing fighter. Thank always, man. Right. Thank you, Oscar. Always. Thank always. you. Now let's see if the judges do the right thing. Dave Moretti and Steve Weisfeld both have it 115, 113. Glenn Feldman scores it, 116 to 112. All three scores go to the winner by unanimous decision. Now the unified middleweight champion of the world, Saul Canelo. Um, he's a strong force. Um, even though I'm the bigger guy, you can tell, you know, he was there to fight. Um, we both was banging. <laughs> We both was landing. Eh, 
Cruz es un gran peleador, un peleador difícil. Lo sabíamos, sabíamos que teníamos que tener la paciencia que tuvimos para ganar y... I'm a naturally big guy, and uh, I might have just overgrown the middleweight division, but man, I, I'm, I'm extremely happy. Like, this is for me, a dream come true still. Win, lose, or draw, I, I was able to perform at the highest level. I still think that I have a, a career that should be thriving after this because super middleweight division is still jam-packed and um, we'll see what happens. Mami, voltea para allá, mira. Pues muy contento, muy contento porque todo salió como, como esperábamos. Ganando round con round y gracias a Dios tenemos otro título más, ¿no? Y, y... Quiero agradecerles el apoyo que siempre, que siempre me han brindado y vamos por más todavía. <risa> 